Alright, I'm back and I was planning on making a Dr. Phil episode, but Dr. Phil just hasn't been the same recently. He was popping a few years back when Daniel Bragoli was on his show, and it's funny because I remember her saying something about that. You've gotten a lot of tension on the internet since you were here. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Both. What's good about it? Well, I guess what's good for you is I made you just like how Oprah made you. You were nothing before I came on this show. Thank you for that. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. You know, when she said that, we all wished she was joking, but she was right. Daniel Bergoli now has more clout than Dr. Phil. Like, how did this happen? How did we let this happen? Like, Dr. Phil is a legend. Like, he made this girl famous, and now she has songs with Anneli Choppa. <coughs> Speaking of Enelie Choppa, my first Enelie Choppa is Goofy video got taken down. The video was already copyright claimed, which means they take all the money, which I don't really care. You could take the money. I'm going to be honest, there's not much to take from. But yeah, and then they blocked it, so I just re-uploaded it and changed the title to Is Not Goofy. And then I changed it back to Is Goofy. And then I changed it back to Is Not. And then I changed it back to Is Goofy. So I don't know which one he is now. Maybe... I was the goofy one this whole time. Nah, there's no way. Come on. But yeah, anyway, this video is going to get copyrighted too, but it don't matter because I think I just found the next Danielle Bregoli. And this time it's on Jerry Springer. Let's check it out. Uh, Sierra, what's going on? My ex roommate slash, I guess, ex best friend. Yeah. And I are having a dispute over my dog. She's not giving me visitation rights to him. And... <laughs> Wait, over your dog? Alright, the show barely started yet and I could tell this guy in the back is loving it. I don't know why he's so excited about somebody's dog. Wait, so this girl basically went on Jerry Springer because her roommate stole her dog? I don't know why you had to go on Jerry Springer for that. Like, is this man really gonna help? Let's find out. Yes, we have a, like basically a child together. You and your roommate. Uh, Ex-roommate. Ex oh, I see. Yeah. So when you were roommates, you had the dog. Yes, that's what we I see. potentially got for And so how did you break up? I mean, how did she, she just left or? Well, we were roommates and she ended up, you know, like we were together, you know, yeah. best friends and all sharing a room and she ended up starting to escort oh. slash being a stripper. And so I ended up kicking her out because I mean, there was just too many guys in and out and I got tired of it. So you said you're out of here, but the dog went too. Yes, one day oh. when I was at work, she ended up leaving, taking the dog, taking the bed, taking a bunch of our accessories that oh. we had together that yeah. I also invested into. I see. And it's, I just want to see my dog. So okay, like, so you don't care, you're not trying to get her back to roommate or nothing no, like that? No, I just, I want my child. You, you want your dog. <laughs> I you want, want my dog. child. Oh, at least, oh, there's the dog, oh. Alright, this dog is pretty cute, but why does everyone do that for like every single dog they see? Like, I feel like it could be one of the most hideous dogs in existence, and people will still go, aww. Like, imagine her dog looked like this. At least, oh, there's the dog, oh. They probably would still say it, but I can't blame them, dogs are cute. Even this one, uh, kind of, I mean. Yeah, is, is that a uh, female or man? It's a boy. His name's Kilo. It wouldn't be the first time we had a bitch on the show. I'll bet it Whoa, Jerry coming in with some fire roasts. I don't know who he's talking about, but I feel like he has somebody in mind. And what's her name? Not the dog, uh, her. Kendall. Kendall. Here's Kendall. So are you gonna give me my visitation rights to my dog back or what? Oh, my dog? No, my dog. The one that's the one that I house? gave you a ride to to go get the dog. Who's paid for his vet bills and his food? I took you there. Did you train when him? When you were being a stripper and an escort, there were you and doing all the him. nights that I was at work and you were at home with him. And I was always taking care of him. I was always walking okay. him. I was always doing everything with him. So when him. you were working at the club too. Who do you think was taking care of him? Wait, this is all for a dog? This is what we're fighting for in 2019? Like, I know how to end this right now. Hey, can I have my dog back? Nah. I and there we go problem solved like I should be the next Dr. Phil helping people out with their problems you know like my half decent advice could go somewhere actually and maybe my advice might make people's problems worse but I'm trying my best all right I've been trying to text you how many times you've texted me one time and said that you were gonna come see him because you had one of your boy toys that was gonna <laughs>
Wait, what was that? I wanted to see some action. All I saw was two girls hugging it out. Is this how girls fight? Because I swear this is also how girls act when they haven't seen each other in a while. Like, oh my god, Kindle, is that you? Oh my god. Also, why is the crowd chanting Jerry? Jerry has nothing to do with this. He's just on the side watching this too. Maybe if Jerry got in the fight, now that's, now that's some action. If you think you're mad about the dog, Wait till I tell you about me and your man at Lights All Night. You slept with a boyfriend, you're saying? I don't think they were dating. She's got multiple oh. boyfriends, yeah. but... I love this security guard right here. Like, he's like... Eh, I, I want to stop him, but I kind of want to see this too. I don't want to get fired though, so I'm going to kind of act like I'm doing something. I had ran into him. He looked so cute. He had a man bun. <laughs> All right, I'm going to be honest. This is like the first time I'm watching Jerry Springer, but is this what usually happens? Half the time they're roasting each other, the other half they're boxing. Like, if this is what it is, this is epic. Like, why have a press conference and then the boxing match when you could just put it all into one? Jerry might be onto something here. For everybody. Obviously, on a you're being elected a whole lot more. Well, let's I don't meet the no dog. Funny. I feel so bad for this dude. He looks so nice. He kind of reminds me of Ned Flanders. You know, he came out here. He's like, hey, diddly do. How y'all doing today? But this girl was not having it. Smack cam. Bitch, I hope the fuck you do. You'll be like. But honestly, it's this guy's fault. I don't know what he was expecting. Were you expecting a kiss or something? Like you just cheated on her and then standing next to her like you wanted a hug or something. Like you kind of deserved it, to be honest. How long have you two been going together? Five, six months, maybe. Yeah. Not too long, you know, just figuring stuff out. Yeah. And she helped you figure it out? A couple things, yes. Yeah. <laughs> what do you want to say to him? You're a dirty whore just like her. He don't even know what to say anymore. I think she slapped all the confidence out of this man. You know, he came out here in the beginning all overconfident, and now he doesn't want to say anything. Who's Maybe Gracie? I'll... My best friend. Oh, your and best you friend. you need to step the hell away from me. Right. You can go be with that whore Here's over Gracie. there. Wait, who is that now? How many people do they have in the back just waiting to come out? Next thing you know, freaking Scooby-Doo himself is gonna come out and start roasting this other dog. Um, yeah, well, how, how do you figure into that? You guys are friends? You're gonna need yes, to help best friend. these two. And what can you add to the story? Okay, so I'm here because yes. of this girl. Screw all these people. Um, well, that's happened not already, working. yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right, that's fine, but don't ever diss the security guard like that. That's my guy. Like, he knows when to stop a fight or when to keep it going. He is actually the real reason why I'm watching this. You like, look at this girl. <laughs> like, seriously. <laughs> and I'm here. Oh, I also want to get my first kiss today, my lesbian kiss, because I've never had it. And the guys in the crowd go wild. They definitely want to see that. Just, I mean, just look at this dude. This guy is too excited. <laughs> and that's where we stop the video there. That's, I'm sorry to tease you. I'm sorry. Wait, I'm sorry. I didn't, I can't show it. L listen, I, all right, fine, fine, fine. I'll show it. I'll show it. It's not even that interesting, but whatever. Here. And that's how it ends. I just watched this whole thing, but I seriously don't know what just happened or what I just watched. Like, I thought this was supposed to be about the dog and then her boyfriend came out and then she turned gay. Like, what? I think I'm more lost now than when we started. I don't know what just happened. But I think we found the next Daniel Brogoli. I think this is it. When is her rap career gonna start? I'm waiting on it. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end. Hopefully you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.